Things took an unexpected wild turn in the loyal test for you. Wow. Yep, they just pulled in. He just got out of the car. Okay, perfect. You guys are in position. You guys are nice and hiding. Yep, yep. We uh ducked off on the side. There he is. There he is. We see him. Allow me to reintroduce you mm -hmm. to the homie Xavier. As some of you remember, we filmed a video with him where he was ready to simp oh, yeah. over a girl. Well, ladies and gentlemen, according to him, his simping days are over. You see, after the release <laughs> of that video, Xavier was getting a lot of love, and he came to the realization that there was no need to simp. Women want him. Okay, I'm good. Alright, copy that. Wow. We're moving into position. Over. Oh, damn, you really parked all illegally, bro. What the hell? Damn, dude. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I gotta make it look realistic. With his newfound confidence, Xavier jumped on dating apps and eventually matched with his girlfriend. We'll just call Wait, her. Wait, he just left his shot in a car? In position. Over. You want me to send in Tim? Yeah, let's go ahead and send Tim in. Over. Having seen our videos, though, and with the state of this dating world, Xavier wanted to make sure that Yuli was loyal. It's your boy Antonio back. We're back with the Riz, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, Xavier told Yuli that he was here to pick up his laptop from his friend's apartment. I wonder if, before they go in there, they got to ask, like, what's your girl's type, right? No? Yeah, they have to. Like, if my girl, like, white, white men, why is Yuli White going to send a black guy to try and get her? They got to ask... They gotta ask the type, right? So she must say, yeah, she'll like, uh, you think he show a list of, we can get him, 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 which one you think she'll like? I'll be some, hey, yo, shit. He parked in his car in the process. It is go time, All right? Here goes Tim. Gonna happen. Our buddy Tim was pretending to be parking enforcement. The plan was for him to issue a ticket. Looks believable. Looks pretty good, yeah, right? Looks good, yeah. Looks good. <laughs> oh, hi. Okay, but you can't park here. Oh, she's talking to him. You know that, right? There's, it's red. It just says no parking. It's all red. Clearly, they're in English. When the time is right, Antonio will Yo. step in and proceed to making his move on Yuli. Will she give him her number and agree to go on a date with him, or will she remain loyal to Xavier? I hope you guys have your talks because you got. Oh, they making this quick. This shit's gonna be. They making this shit quick. I'll do anything to give her a ticket. <laughs> Hopefully, we get one good one. We just need one good one, y'all. Just one. Do you have a permit? Oh, she's oh, getting up the car. Before sending in Antonio, we wanted Yuli to have a feeling of desperation. He just went to pick up something real quick. He's going to be back shortly. Well, how can you call him? Does he have a phone? Yeah. Let okay. Me, let me call him. Let me call him. Okay, yeah, go ahead, call him. And do you, uh, you say you do have a permit? No? no it's yeah, they not, not like, like this, though. Oh, you said we got the parking, the parking pass? pass? Yeah, for this area, because all the Karens, they want people to have permits so they know who lives here and who doesn't. Oh, damn, yeah, most niggas would just rode and left on the car, so too bad. Okay, but I, I already started writing, so I can't stop. And actually, you know what he told me? Do you want me to leave the key? I was like, no, because I was chilling. Oh, she's calling. She's calling. She's calling you? Yeah. All right, I'm just going to ignore it. She's calling him, Antonio. I think he should go ahead and go in now. Go time. Go time, Antonio. Was he on the mic saying go time? Well, how about texting or? Well, that was here in the car. All right, here we go, here we go, here we go, here we go. At least you tried to call me, right? That's pretty cool. Having made the scenario as realistic as possible, Antonio was free to make his move. Yeah, I'm sure. Yeah, that's what they Wait, all why? say, Wait, what is she right? trying to that's call That's what him? they all say. They'll be here in just a we'll moment. Right it's my first time, I swear. Hey, y'all all right? Are you trying to give a tip? Bro, I park here all the time. I live in these apartments over here. Well, a lot of people park here. How long have you been here so far? A few minutes. Just a couple minutes. She ain't even been here that long. Give a tip more. Ten, she's I've been seen here you around for, before. We've already been here for five I've minutes here running around. her up. Most people park here most of the time. So it's like a quick little run here. Most people park here all the time. It's not like abnormal mm. to park here. You like a good man. You like your good people. Come on, you've been 10 minutes. You like your good people. I can't I can't okay. let her park here any longer. Okay, like, so do this. If do I don't this leave me. a ticket, at least. Do don't give it a ticket. I got something for you. I got something for you. Uh -huh. These tickets are not that much. Yeah, yeah, these tickets are not, not that much. I'm not allowed to take bribes. Come on, right? these tickets are not that Okay, you're not convinced. I'm not. I didn't convince you. Okay, let me convince you. Hold on, let me throw a little extra. Okay, I'll take donations. I'll take donations. I'll take donations. Get the I'm gonna take a lap around. I'm gonna take a lap around the block. If it's still here, take two laps. Can you okay. give me two laps? Give me two all laps. Right, That'll be like 10, laps. 15 minutes. All right, all right. Two laps. <laughs> My God. All right, Everybody all right. always park here. They always <laughs> give people tickets here. I'm sorry you had to experience that, Antonio. I, I know it's not necessary, but you got it's good people in the world still. You know, it's still some good people out here. I hear accent. Where are you from? Brazil. I've never been. I've always wanted to go to Brazil. So how long you been here? Uh, for almost a year. Okay. I can tell you've been here not that long because you didn't know not to park in this spot. Yeah. Okay. In LA, anytime you see red, do not 
park. I'm telling you, don't park there. I can't that. <laughs> it's not my fault, actually. My guy just went to pick up something. Right? My oh, guy. Your guy, your guy, your guy, your guy. Okay, that's cool. I'm not originally from here either. I'm uh, originally from Miami, but I live in oh, California okay. now. So you got to teach me Spanish. You got to teach me a little bit of Spanish then, if you're there. Portuguese. Portuguese. Yeah. Oh, Lord. Oh, Lord, I don't messed up. Wait, she's from Brazil, though. Brazilian speak poor. Now I gotta look this shit up. What do Brazil? They do. I did not know that. Oh shit! You learn something new every day, dog. Every day. But she did say, "My guy, what?" So yeah. look, this is what we're gonna do. I'm happy I was able to look out for you, but. We gotta connect. You know, I know you knew you seem like you're good people. You got good energy. I love the energy you put around. Yeah, let's lock in. Hold on. Can I get your number? You just connect, just to, like talk it up. And I can teach you how not to park in she the She said, uh, I don't see that nigga. Yeah. <laughs> what? Y'all niggas be careful out there, man. Literally, look what she just did. You just connect, just to, like talk it up. And I can teach you how not to. She said, yeah, I don't see him. Yeah. The park in the red. Oh. Okay. <laughs> That's cool with you? Good. <laughs> All right, that that shit look crazy. Like I said, I've been through it before. I don't want to see a beautiful but girl. But she can feel like she has to, you know, you though. So <laughs> go ahead and lock All right, wait, wait, wait. Oh. She could have been looking back saying, damn, there's no niggas to save me if I say no and he tried to kill, kidnap me type shit. You gotta eliminate all the excuses, bro. All of them. You have to eliminate all the excuses. And we can go ahead and type in. She really gave him the number. There you go. And uh, it might be a fake one though. Let's, let's give her the benefit of the doubt. It's a pleasure meeting you. Make sure you lock me in. I'm gonna text you. Okay. Get out of this red too. <laughs> I'll see you later. It's a little disappointing, you know. I mean, she was she was being a little friendly. She gave him the number, you know. I felt like she just gave him. She needs her another. Just to, like, needs another part. Yeah, just like See? a little courtesy, you know, right. so hopefully nothing comes about it, you know. I don't know if she'll be okay with me doing that, you know, and, and the fact that she's doing it. Hopefully it's the wrong number. That we still got to give her the benefit of the doubt, you know, see how things go. But you're right, though. Would she be okay with you doing that? She told me she's she's a very jealous woman, so okay. she already told no girlfriends. But okay. uh, I hope she passes this test. I hope that's a fake number and this is all done with. You yeah. know? I don't have to see you again. <laughs> that's <laughs> you know? true. That's uh, true. So I'm, I'm hoping this is it right here, honestly. And uh, I feel it. Well, let's all right, get back, back to the whip. She starts getting suspicious. Yeah, yeah. I think it's always best if your significant other refrains from handing out their number to people that sound interested in getting to know them. Even if they're just being friendly, opening up communication like that can be a gateway to info. I get what he's saying, but so many. Females feel like they just gotta get the number or else they don't know what's gonna happen. Delish. Shit. Let me get the, the backpack so she thinks I really grabbed something. Yeah. <laughs> let's do that. Yep, yep, yep. You got your right, backpack. Cool. Yeah, there it is. All right, so we'll be in touch then, right? Yeah, we'll be in okay. touch. Now let's be real here. We did place Yuli in a situation where she was almost compelled to give Antonio her number. So let's pray that she only did so out of gratitude. The only piece that did stand out to me was that she referred to Xavier as her guy rather than her boyfriend. Her I mean, guy. girls called her boyfriends different things, right? And being that she's a foreigner, it might have just been a language barrier thing. Y'all need a ride? That you makes sense. <laughs> I guess. It's still uncertain if Yuli will remain loyal, but one thing we did know was that she did not give Antonio. Lock me in, beautiful. Got it. Thanks again for the help. A fake number. Got it. Today's a day. It's got to happen. Okay, so hopefully she is. I hope she does it. <laughs> Lock me in, beautiful. Antonio had been in community. Good morning, beautiful. How's your day going? Good morning. It's going good. Just got myself some Starbucks. Old coffee sounds so good right now. I'm about to get me some. What kind you drink? What kind of drink did you get? So if y'all texting a female, right? She put emojis like this. You're going to include emojis in your text or you just going to keep texting the way you is? communication with Yuli and for the most part it was all very cordial she kept saying she was busy whenever Antonio would ask oh wait I'm trying to read it with Yuli and for the most part it was all very cordial she kept oh my god that's too funny for real right that's what I'm saying so I'm trying to get together and grab some food you free this weekend I'm down for a while, but I just work a lot the weekends are usually saying she was busy whenever Antonio would ask her to hang out Oh, for real, what time you work? Maybe we can work around it. 
I work evenings, so I usually sleep in mornings until like ten. But I usually run in my on the weekends. So she's like, Doubt, but she never complete. She's like curving the nigga, but not at the uh. Okay, how about how about throughout the week then? I know we can make this work. We gotta find the right time and day. Make a weekend work. I can make a weekend work. I just have to know ahead of time. But I think Thursdays are my most free day since I work late. Blew them off. In fact, she say less than. Let me check my schedule and see if we should do a Thursday or a weekend. Sounds good. Just so you know, though, I don't have a car, so I can't really worry about that. That's not even a concern. Told them to hit her up on a Thursday, up. as that was. See now you got the emoji now. Free day. So she was like, I don't even think that was curving. I think she was like, hold on, let me hear this phone call. Hello? Hey, what's up, beautiful? How you doing? <laughs> I'm doing good. Oh. She thinking that might be some form of communication, though. I'm doing good. I know we've been texting for a couple of days, so I was like, you know what, let me just pick up the phone and give you a call real quick so I can hear your voice. But also, I want to call you and see if, um, what you doing later on tonight? I actually work tonight. Okay, so let's do this. Let's go grab something to eat real quick before you go uh, to work. Um, Did you eat yet? No, I actually haven't. Well, see, you got this call at the perfect time, then. Let's go grab some food there real quick. What's your favorite spot? Like, what you trying? What you want to eat? Perfect you want time, man. Expensive stuff. Where you trying to go? No, no, no. Let's do something casual because I don't want to like dress up or anything. Let's just can we do like something casual? Yeah, that's cool. I know uh, we can go like by Panera Bread. That's not too far from my spot, so uh, we can go by there, grab something quick, real quick. We ain't gotta do nothing Panera too crazy. Bread? Yeah, Panera. What's that? What? You ain't never been Panera? Oh yeah, that's what we're doing. Don't even don't even ask no more questions. What? Just get ready. Just throw on some real, you know, real casual. I'll be over there to get you in a little bit. That work for you? That works perfect. All right, cool. So I'll be there by the hour too. Send me your uh, address. Okay. All right, beautiful. Bye. Later. I don't know about you guys, but I would not like my girlfriend having lunch with a man who is clearly into her. Well, I'm three minutes, four minutes for picking. Nah, my nigga. Nah, that phone call. Nah, bro. Nah. No. That shit went too smooth. Okay, sounds good. Just text me when you get her then. Okay, will do. Okay, cool. We're on our way already too. While Antonio made his way to pick up Yuli, we made our way to Panera Bread. Just keep an eye out for the parking lot if you see them. Honestly, dude, I think it's gonna take him like 30 to 40 minutes. Yeah, she lives pretty far from this location. Yeah. So you were trying to be a passport, bro. I was trying. I was trying she to get gonna be late for work. You know? <laughs> trying to get Brazil in here. I'm low-key tempted to go into the drive-thru and get something. You gonna take that long? What do you think? Are you hungry? Uh, not really. <laughs> After waiting for quite some time, our patience eventually paid off. You're on the other side of these cars. <gasps> there they are, there they are, there they are. Elias, come in. Over. Go ahead. Unless you want to think about going in I guess it ain't dressing up. Something? Yeah, I can do that. How close should I sit? Right up on their asses. Yo. Left, left out. He wants to know if he can come in with me. You can take him in there with you. With the second half of our team getting closer coverage, phase two was in full swing. Oh, there they are. Oh, 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 here we go. Come on, camera, focus, bitch. There really wasn't anything that we Outside? were listening out for. We just wanted Antonio to get more acquainted All right, with you. Hold on, it's far from her house. So she probably expecting, oh, that nigga ain't gonna be, uh, my guy ain't gonna be out here 30 minutes from my crib. Eating outside while with another nigga when you have a nigga is crazy. Yeah, I have some fucking confidence. Let me swing around, try to get another angle. This is, this is a spot right there in front. I don't want to go too close, though. I mean, they don't know your car, so. True. And your windows are tinted. This was supposed to be a very simple phase, but as you guys will see, things got very interesting very quickly. We're in a whole relationship. Come out here with another dude. Yeah, she, she just mad. It's crazy. Oh, fully's ready. <laughs> she's by herself. Should I, should I send her a text? Ask what she's doing. Try calling her. Let's call her. Yeah, try calling her. Um, just give her a shot. Cause he's not. Bro, that shit. Um, you. Uh, I feel like that shit's just gonna throw her off. Uh, like she's gonna be like, I'm here with this neck. Like, like she was probably. She could have been second guessing about going or whatever. Then you call it, and you really Damn, make it like. Oh. Yeah, that's good. This is Let's good. see. I don't know. Some people are heartless. Wait, She's getting the question second and fourth. Oh, but Antonio's coming back. She answers. Oh, she's she gonna answer. Put that shit she down. Should have called faster. Why is she clapping? Damn, bro, Antonio came back at the Why is he laughing? 
I'm gonna send her this thing is laughing. She, she respond. As I'm sure you guys might have guessed, Yuli never gave Xavier a call or text back. She's ignored my ass, huh? She literally she looked at her, her phone. phone. Yeah, she I saw it. I saw it. it. I saw it. I'll be going back here for the streets. Just out of curiosity, what do you think she <laughs> would say if you walked up dog. there right now? We're like, what's up? What are you doing here? She'll try to blow this off like it was nothing. That's what she's gonna do. Oh, if I if I confront her, oh, I just fool. We didn't do anything. I already know how she is. Because they really haven't done too much. Yeah. You know, she go, oh, it's just my mm -hmm. friend. You know, I already know how she is. Surely we know what's going on. While Yuli never hit Xavier back, Antonio shot me a text. It was a little broken, but I think what he meant to say was, I can get her back to the apartment. She sounds down to go finish this today <laughs> yeah, Tony was confident oh my <laughs> god so the original plan was for them today to eat just food then you want to just try to finish this whole thing today yeah no, no, honestly no. It, if she wants to do more with him after this like if it's she over, just said go she got work another day go back to her house i'm like i'm, I'm what time you want to finish everything today Otherwise, we could stick to the game plan and uh, see if she shows up to a house or whatever. I think we just get, out, get us out the way, man. Get it out yeah, the way. if you can get it today, do it today, because she busy, right? Pretend like I still care about her, you know. She goes over it to wrap. You sure? 100% positive? Let's wrap it up today. Wait, we head out right now, you think? Yeah, that's what okay. I was thinking. Okay. Yeah, man, I'm 100% positive. This is it, then. We are going. No turning back now. All right, so, bro. Before making our way back to the apartment, we handed our crew a small mic that they would hand off to Antonio discreetly in the men's restroom. We're at the hurry, so we could beat him there. I know we're going to have to hurry. We weren't terribly concerned with time because Antonio could have just stalled and keep us updated. What had us more concerned were the cameras, hidden mics, and the light feed that we had to set up. We weren't uh -huh. planning on shooting Facebook three today so we weren't sure if everything was charged but hey things like this are unpredictable and we had to trust antonio's judgment she's gonna come over she said that's, yeah that's what he said I, i'm assuming that's what he means by that my apartment is a go <laughs> all right that was good i live like maybe like six seven minutes from here let me get chill for a second at least until you go to work so you're gonna go all the way home it's still early luckily we were able to make all the, right, make the equipment that we had we let antonio know where the cameras were pointing and what Bought a wine on the stool, over a glass. These niggas got this shit yeah, playing the fuck which out. included a bottle of wine, and then we just got into position. Let me get your dough. Let me get your dough. This is when it starts to really get real. Yeah. As of right now, Antonio hasn't really made his intentions clear. Here in this portion, Antonio's gonna ask her out. Hopefully, when he's doing all that, she says, "I got a man. I gotta stay loyal to him." We're yeah. in a committed relationship, man. So that's the least you can do. I don't know any friends. I'm going to the house, and yeah, you know, something's not really happening. Wow. You know, so even if she passes, it's still definitely a conversation. That alone. Uh, yeah. Uh, enough for me, you know. She, she's doing things behind my back. She's being dishonest. Yeah. yeah. Um, all, all things I can't do. Oh, Where was she dishonest at, though? Okay. I think okay, we huh? should uh, get ready to listen in. I mean, honestly, the only way I would continue anything is if she le left right now, gave me a call, explained what she was mm. doing, and like, that's understandable. Woo! All right. Come on in, come on in. Welcome, welcome, Mikase Sukasa. I don't know how to say the Portuguese. I was gonna try to say it, but I ain't gonna try. I'm gonna mess up myself. Mm. You want something to drink? You good? I think we should do a little wine. We had some food. Wine I mean, before I like, top work. It off with the wine. What you think? Okay, okay. Get you ready for work. <laughs> we should have put a camera in the kitchen. It's all good. It's all good. Do it by yourself. Yeah. What about you, a roommate? Yeah. I have oh, oh, oh. Don't mind that. <laughs> all right. I wish. Already I drunk. Why. There's just no other reason for her to be here. She could have got the lunch, left home, and, and you know, go to rest. Right. I not, nah, but see, this is where you gotta. Where she work? You gonna drive her 30 minutes home for her to drive 30 minutes back? Nah, there ain't no way she going to work in that, right? That part, they uh, they should explain that part. To do anything for her, he's not offering to like help her out with anything. The only reason she's here is because she's interested in him. No one's ever that friendly, you know. Right. No, no one's ever that friendly. You only do this for a reason. Like you're into the dude, you like the dude. You want to sit over here real quick? We got the wine. We go have a seat real quick, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, sure. Come on, come on, have a seat for me. Antonio finally brings Yuli in perfect line of our cameras. Before making his move, though, he spends a considerable amount of time just making small talk and browsing through Netflix. Oh, there's Elias. There's the rest of the team. That's my shit. The little kid with the oh, little horns. Yeah. That's my stuff. <laughs> what you know about Sweet Tooth? Hold on, I knew you was good people. Yo, I knew you she was having good a good people. time. Antonio and Yuli definitely seem to be getting along. Unfortunately, the two genuinely seem to be making a connection. They clone Tyrone. You seen that? No. Now listen, let me tell you something. They clone Tyrone was lit. No, don't put on a movie, bro. <laughs> get to the test. <laughs> Antonio was taking a little bit too much time, so I eventually texted him to just get to it. There was no definite <laughs> This nigga was about to watch a whole movie. This nigga done forgot. He done forgot this shit was a test.
He out here vibing, bro. Oh, no. These two are vibing. Their body language said it all. I don't like that body Holy language. Holy shit. There's just a lot of space on that couch. She could easily move over. She could go sit on the other couch. She shouldn't have been here in the first place, you know? If I'm if I'm funny, that means you're having a good time, right? So that means you're going to call off work, and we're going to continue this, right? What? You mean tonight? Yeah. You, ain't, you don't... <laughs> You don't have to go to work, like, per se. You can get, like, a call-off day. No, I can't. I can't do... I can't pull that off, like, right now. Now things were starting to get interesting. My boy Antonio wasn't just trying to make his move. He was trying to get her to call off work. Hold on. <laughs> what, what What? you usually... This how nigga much you was make? actually trying to how get How much her. you make at work tonight? No. How much you usually make? It's not about the money. How much you make tonight? No, it's not about the how money. How much you make? If you... Let me... Let me, let me let's, let's see. If you make... Twenty dollars an hour, twenty five dollars an hour. We gonna double that, so we gonna say you make fifty an hour. Fifty times we gonna say you you there for about what six hours well, if you start at eight. Depends for the tips and everything, but it's not about the money. You it's about look. Lying I want you to know. take this. No. So you can just chill. We supposed to be here chilling. You know what I'm saying? We having a good time. I feel like we look. We should continue this. I feel like the vibe is right for us to chill. No, it's just one night. I ain't saying like oh come stay for like five six days. Just just tonight, one night. So I finished like around one ish. Mm -hmm. I don't know if it's too late for you, and mm -hmm. if you want like meet out later. Yeah, you got me fucked up. That's oh. cool. You say get a what, what, what? one. Say less. Say less, then. And then what? You're gonna pick me up? Gonna, can you Uber me or like? Yeah, I can send you Uber. I can come scoop you. Listen, like I said, beautiful girls get what they want. So you say Antonio, come get me. I'm coming to get you. Yo. Yo. Are you like one? I'm a night owl. Even if I was a night owl, if you ask me, I'm a. All right, my niggas. To get off at one, you niggas staying up for it? I know niggas are staying up for it. I know niggas are staying up. She gets off at one. So she probably thinking he going to Uber her to the crib and she's going to shower whatever at his crib, right? One o'clock. Y'all niggas staying up for that shit? I know some niggas that can't stay up past 10 o'clock. That just made me sound fucking old. Oh shit. One o'clock, you niggas staying up for, bro? Shit, if you ain't got work the next day, be a night out. just play some fucking Spider Man until it's so what one. What you try to do? What's up? Well, maybe I can come back. Like, See, I don't like that word, maybe. I don't like that word, maybe. You got obligations? You think you think about your dude? Is that what kind of got you like going back and forth? Um, a little bit. Do you think y'all really that serious? Or are y'all just kicking it? Or what is like the real deal with y'all? Um, I don't know. I feel like I have ups and downs with that. Yeah. So you really, you know, you tell me if I'm wrong. I feel like you like the dude, but you feel like you want to keep your options open. That's what it sound like to me. That's just what, right? I mean, don't, look, I'm not trying to put words in your mouth. I'm just trying to get a better understanding for me. Just so I know how, like, how we can kick it. Yeah, yeah. And I mean, yeah. So you good with staying here with me and we can kick it for the night? Yeah, I'm done, man. I'm done with her. Fuck all that. Nah, he's talking about sleeping over. That's it. Yeah, that's it, dude. Yeah, nah, I'm good. At 1 a.m., I don't think it's no going home at 1 a.m., right? We <laughs> want. As long as you go with us laying together. Thank you. We grown. Thank you. We grown. That's what I'm talking about. <laughs> Damn. That's how she feels? Cheers to being grown. Uh, thank you to him for not getting mad at the nigga. Because, you know, some of these niggas get on here and get mad at the nigga for doing his job. He doing a good-ass job. We don't want none of that fake ass shit. What he's doing right now is what the niggas out going to bag your bitch is going to fucking do. This nigga putting on a fucking show. He doing his job. We got to be cheers to being grown in this thing. Let's go. Mm -hmm. I'm literally right outside and she's having a whole nother relationship with this dude trying to commit. I'm about this nigga mad as hell. At least oh my the money, God. Man, and she actually likes this dude. She, she just wants to come back and spend time with him. Yeah, you oh, know she like that nigga. Yeah, 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 no, I'm, yeah, <laughs> Why are you laughing? Stop laughing, bro. Yo, you do this that you can't be laughing at that and nigga like that. That's so fucked right up. Now, and I'm sure she'd oh, go yeah. for it. I already seen enough, man. If this were a real situation, bro, Antonio would have capitalized a long time ago, dude. She's doing this to herself. How you know she that? She put herself in that room. She put herself in the house. She didn't have to. Yeah, stop chatting for this nigga make his move. He gonna forget. This nigga forget he acted. She's doing everything. I'm good, bro. 
I'm good. Yeah. I trusted her, man. She seemed like a genuine, honest woman. You know, she's not from America. I was like, all right, cool. She's not, you know, westernized yet, but but I guess they're all the same everywhere we go. She's going to come fuck this dude, you know? She's going to come back. That, that's she, basically what that's, she's that's agreeing or saying that she wants to do. We're all grown. She cheers that we're grown. Like, yeah, you know, we know what grown-ups do when they're alone, sleeping over together, and this is not who I want to be with. And with that, Xavier decides Damn. to confront Yuli. Now, big props to Antonio. He definitely showed a lot of respect and restraint to not hook up with the homie's girl. This was one of those tests where if he wanted to, he could have. Fuck this bitch, she's for the streets. She's for, she's for it's the It's crazy. We, we, that nigga put right that, back. bro, that nigga put that shit on this episode, dog. We ain't gonna lie, dog. We ain't. This nigga put that shit on. He done forgot he was acting. He forgot this was an episode, bro. That nigga was ready to start that Netflix show, bro. This nigga forgot this was all an act. This nigga fucking with her, she fucking with him. Oh my God. Where she came from. <laughs> the streets, not Brazil. The streets, the streets. <laughs> You're not gonna cry. So with that being said, ladies and gentlemen, a plus boo. You guys about this that nigga put that below. shit on this and episode, bro. Oh, you guys... look, look, she about, uh, it's crazy. She was having a good ass time with this nigga too, bro. That one o'clock shit is crazy though. All right. Go to work, come back at one. Niggas is going, niggas will stay up for bro. This shit's gonna be. She was having a good ass time, bro. Oh shit. <sighs> now she gotta walk home. What's going on? Oh. What do you mean? What the fuck? What, what are you doing? What you What you got going on? What do you mean? What the fuck? What do you mean? What do I mean? Look. look. Uh, here with another her group? English sound better. Don't go that. What, what are you looking scared for? What the fuck are you doing here? What, what am I doing here? What are you doing here? I'm just, I'm just having a conversation. You're just having a conversation with just, just a friend, huh? You know I saw everything, right? You know I've been, I've been knowing what's going on since the beginning. What do you mean everything? This entire thing was basically all just a test. Xavier wanted to find out if you were truly loyal to him or not, so that's why we had Antonio pretend to be into you, ask you on a fucking date. Bag, the truth is, though, like she look this upset. Real. Antonio's not really into you. He was just doing all of this. Oh. Man, why would you do this? Why would I? Do she this? about to go I, back I expect, to Brazil. I didn't expect her to go this way. I didn't do anything. Oh, you didn't do anything? No. Look, I've been seeing from the day you got his number, from the day you went texting, from you went out to go have lunch with him. Now you're back at his crib. I saw everything that went on. Like, this is ridiculous. Oh, ridiculous that I believed you. I thought you were gonna be faithful. I thought you were gonna be loyal. I thought you were different. I, didn't do I walk in his all, his arm around you, and that's not nothing. You're talking about you're gonna come over later well, after you're work. Not a liar, you. So everything was just a fucking setup. You are the liar it's, here. No, no. Look, because I wanted. I want you to talk to me. You have concerns. This probably. You're not a freaking, a freaking man. Oh, I'm not a man. You're not a woman. You can't even stay low to your man. We have, we're, we're in a committed relationship. You're over here committing to coming back to sleep with it's another man? Lungs, okay? Chill. Oh, that's how you feel. Mm. What if the roles were reversed? What if he was doing what you just did right now? Would you be upset? Would you be mad? Uh, well, depends. You, I'm not cheating on you. This is not yeah, cheating. Yeah, you're not cheating. Yeah, no, you're about I'm not to. not fucking anyone. Oh, yeah, you're about to fuck. Well, you're drinking. You're going to come over at one. He's, well, you did the best you could. Well, I'm just trying to help. My dog out here just figure out what's going on in his life because oh, I'm just trying to make sure he's good. Me. It's you could have said no. I'm just keeping it real. When I when I asked for the number, you could have easily been like, this I can't be touching up their relationship, <laughs> man. What? That's no, why no. you're fucking single. Oh, that's why I'm single. I thought that's we were together. That's why you've been fucking single. Yes. I am gonna be single because someone like you, I want nothing to do with. You're tripping. Oh, you're breaking up with me. I'm bre yeah, it, I've been done. I, I thought that was the case. I, I thought you were I, thought we I want to make you look like a clown in front of everybody. Overreacting. This is just an idea. Just overreacting. I look, do anything yet. that's fine. That's fine. Yes. What would, have happened, what would have happened if you would have came here later tonight at one But I didn't. But what would have happened if you did? You I were planning know. on it. Nothing? Like, we're done. I want nothing to do with you. That's ridiculous. Oh, it's ridiculous? Over this shit. Of course I'm dumping over this shit. What do you want me to do? Let you go sleep up with the other men? Man, you got me. She was ready to stay with him. Oh, you deserve better. I deserve better. How about that? You're the one that's cheating. I was loyal to you. I gave you everything you wanted. Come on now. Exactly oh, what the I fuck I'm talking about. You, man. I can't believe you did this. We're done. It's unacceptable that you do Under this. Yeah, I'm glad it's unacceptable. Right We're now? done. I want nothing to do with you. You mean this nothing not to me. This is not okay. This is not okay. Man. Oh, this is not okay? You're no. not okay. You're messed up in the head. You need to go sleep with all these other guys while you're in a relationship. You're the one that said you're in a committed relationship. What's you're saying you're one, you're running errands and you're over here about to sleep with another man. What's my personal Oh, okay. look, we'll keep it personal because I don't want nothing to do with you. Nothing. We're done. Fuck you, man. Fuck, fuck me. Fuck you. Fuck you. Fuck oh. Get the hell out of here. Oh. I am leaving. I am leaving. That's what I am doing right now. 
Yo! <laughs> oh, man, I didn't even have time to react to that. Are you good, Antonio? She threw that at you. You good? You sure? It hit me. I'm just a little like. Oh Damn, right shit! <laughs> she really just threw that glass at me, and Yo. I didn't do shit. I ain't cheat. Oh my shoes! Oh no! Not the shoes. No! Not the shoes. Now you gotta give them away. Yeah, no, yeah, we might have to sue her. Bro, in a white shirt. <laughs> She's so true. She was obviously Damn. in you. Why'd she have to get me? A casualty of war, my <laughs> casualty, casualty, casualty of war. Yo! Oh, shit. He didn't uh, say keep digging. That's crazy. That's crazy. Yeah, nah, bro. That nigga bagged the fuck out of her. We ain't gonna cap, bro. Xavier put that shit on, bro. That nigga put that shit on. Oh, shit. 